Hi everyone, this is Group 9. We'll be presented by Ong Kao, Chayapon and Winokini. And we will present about constant speed pro propeller, propeller installation, safety uh, propeller, and spinal installation. The propeller converts rotational power from the engine into thrust. The rotational power is called torque. A constant speed propeller keeps the propeller pitch adjusted for maximum efficiency for most conditions of flight. The component in charge of it all is called the governor. The governor moves oil back and forth through the propeller hub to make sure the prop is at the pitch and speed that you want. So how do you use a constant speed prop on a flight? What's really happening is that you're increasing the angle of attack of the propeller, and in turn, increasing the torque required of the engine to swing the propeller around. Now, moving the propeller lever forward. By moving the lever forward, you give yourself more instantaneous power, because the engine doesn't need to work as hard to turn the propeller. A constant speed propeller gives blade pitch angle the ability to be continuously and automatically adjusted in flight to maintain constant and efficient engine speed needed for any situation. It also makes the plane more adaptable to different phases of flight. And last off, with an extra engine control in the cockpit. There are two types of propellers installed on current production airplanes which are fixed pitch propellers and hydraulically actuated constant speed propellers. Constant speed propeller systems consist of single acting propeller and double acting propeller. Single acting propeller. A single acting propeller has a pitch changing mechanism that utilizes hydraulic force to fine off the pitch. Double acting propeller. A double acting propeller has a pitch changing mechanism that utilizes hydraulic force to fine off as well as to course in the pitch. This shows the pitch changing mechanism. Flat over shaft. You see, we can found on the prop engine and mods flat opposed. If you see the face of the shaft, it is formed into four to eight inch across and you also probably to the center lines. That's the type of flat cup shaft that we can found with a double pin and mountain boat hole. These two type are machine into flex and or some flex and fit insert and press into the ball hole. Next step is the type of popular cup shafts. Why they call this type because the design of the cup is like the tempered. And usually, usually we can found on the older model instead engine with a low half power. And this type of cup have a hub. It have used to adapt the popular to the shaft and act like the key way to prevent the rotation. The, la the last type of shaft that I want to explain was spine shaft. Spine shaft, where we can find it? We can find it on most radar engine and also some flat concentrated opposed in line and ever to mobile engine. The concept of spine shaft has growth and the spine with economization and a master of double width so that the hub will fit on the shaft in only one position. Way to explain the shifting uh, propeller and, and the uh, spinner installation. So as you know, this is the spinner and then the shifting 
uh, board inside the spinner. Our modern propeller driver added have the spider over their hub due to aerodynamic function of streaming the engine installation and directly to air into the opening in the tower. Now, I will show you the illumination of installing the spider. So the, the bucket is installed on propeller shaft line and held in place by six bolts. And the spinal support is required to secure the bucket. Wish we could turn back time to the good old days.